Hey, what's up? My name's John Mata, and I'm gonna talk to you about RAR algae oil. But first, a little bit about me. I'm a professional skateboarder and co-founder of RAR Life, a whole food supplement company started back in 2012. After our superfoods product played a part in helping me through some health issues. A few years later, in 2015, we came out with our go-to omega-3 product for DHA and EPA, which was acryl oil. At the start of 2019, we switched that up for algae oil. We've known about algae oil since 2015, but more often than not, it was extracted with hexane. And there's always been debate around the safety of that extraction process. So as soon as we found a hexane-free source, we hopped on it and made the switch from krill to algae. Aside from the dozens of benefits DHA and EPA provides the body, algae oil has a higher absorption rate than both fish or krill oil, and you won't have any fishy burps. It also doesn't require the body to convert it from ALA either, like it poorly does with chia, flax, and other plant-sourced omega-3s, but it still happens to be vegan-friendly. So everyone can use it. Both fish and krill happen to get their omega-3s from algae. Being that algae is so low on the food chain, it doesn't have a chance to build up environmental toxins, like the heavy metals that have been found in fish. It's grown on ponds in the southwest US with the sun and renewable energy, so it's not contributing to any overfishing that may be happening, nor is it disturbing any wildlife food chains. Our algae oil also carries along other natural nutrients that help prevent it from oxidation. And this isn't the case with all algae or fish oil. Now taking everything I just said into consideration, we believe algae oil is the best source to get DHA and EPA currently, and the future of omega-3s overall. So hopefully this gives you a little insight and understanding as to why we made the switch from krill to algae oil. So go to the site, pick yourself up some product, and enjoy. Peace.